2022 is yeah, it's been amazing. It's been amazing for MMA, uh, MMA, and, and, and Sosa, Sosa Studio MMA itself. Um, guys, have, we went our first time ever competed as an Namibian team in the IMF African Games. We went with three gentlemen, came home with three uh, three medals. As you can see, it's in the trophy cabinet still. Vaya got the gold medal. He's the African champion um, of, uh, of IMF and all that kind of story. Geraldo also. We had the likes of Eduardo Platt that also was supposed to compete, but got an injury on his hand, so he couldn't compete. Ronaldo also hurt his shoulder, couldn't compete. Damian Muller also had tore his, uh, his arm in, 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 in training camps and all that kind of story. And it's been amazing, it's been amazing years. And then it's just been a continuous, because we've been participating in other events like GFC, we've been going there. Vey has put up his record to 5-0. and oh. He's sitting there 5 and, sorry, 5-1. and one. He's got his 5-1 and one record, so um, it's amazing. We have also hosted uh, an event, AFL, this year in Namibia. At SKW. Sosa also revealed that for 2023 the studio will be a hub of activities, adding that one of his athletes will soon conclude a professional contract. I don't know if Vaya will be competing then because after the Worlds he's got, I've got two contracts on my desk as we speak but they wanted to go pro professional. So we are looking at that, we are very excited about it. Obviously once you go pro, you get a lot of you get to go, you get perks. Everything gets, comes with the territory, and we're looking at we need to go through that avenue to reach the top, as likes of UFC, UFC, Bellator, or any of those things. So the sport is growing in 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 in, 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 in uh, Namibia. So we're trying to develop it also. We've also got uh, I've also put time into guys from uh, other districts, other re regions, where. They're coming and they're learning the art by me and then they're taking it back to, to, to their club and obviously coaching them and all that kind of story. So that's how we're getting the sports out there. So I've got a gentleman from the north that's coming down. I've got a gentleman from Swakop that's coming in. And obviously I've got another two gentlemen that are from other districts, but they are based in here at the moment. We're also coaching a gentleman from Zambia and a gentleman from DRC that, uh, that, are, getting, that are getting ready for the Worlds. I mean, obviously they need to do all the paperwork still and all the red tape that needs to be done to be part of the Worlds. Um, but that's in their hands. But we, they, are, they are training with the national Namibian team that is going to the world in uh, 2023.